Hey everyone, welcome back to Yakuza Kiwami 2. We're back with the Majima Saga. Uh, we just finished off with the part with uh, Makoto, which is very sad. Uh, Majima finally got his closure and pretty much a goodbye for Makoto. So that was very sad, but it was very good for Majima as well. Um, after 18 years, he's finally got uh, closure to everything. We're going to carry on with the story now. We know that Kawamura, who's working for us, is being a bit shady. He's the one that killed Uematsu and it look, and it made it look like he's trying to frame Majima. So now we're just at the Grand and it looks like there's a crowd forming. So let's see what's happening here. Let's go guys. Someone called the police. Are they filming something? Is there something up, happening up there? I don't know. Let's just go in and see what's happening. Huh. This is the end of the road, I'd say. Should I handle business, or am I being hasty? Bustin! Ah. <laughs> Alright, it's on. Okay, so there... This is the final boss, I'm guessing. Sorry. <laughs> に取るんや。上松やったもん。お前なんか。はい。Oof. All right. Okay, so it looks like he's his job was to take down a few of the yet Tojo clan captains. Ah, shit! I don't. I really don't like. <laughs> nice. Come on, fight me like a man, Kamura. But yeah, is it because of um, just money problems, eh, that he's acting like this? やっぱり強いっすね。親父は。もう少し早く親父に会えてたら人生変わってただろうな。カムラ。お前なんでこないなこと。Who is it? He's dead. He's dead. Is it Ibuki? Yeah, it's Ibuki. Yoku Gambatana, Kamura. Fox. Koradeo Mino Shakim, Chara Nisterio. Ibuchi. Ibuchi. Keep saying the wrong thing. Ugly. Bakato Hasami or Tsukayo. なんて言葉がありますが、本当にその通りだ。借金肩代わりするだけで、何でもしてくれるんですからね。金と暴力ちらつかせるだけでいい。極道社会ってのは本当にくだらないが楽ですね。全てお前が裏でいいと引いとった
あまりにも非効率すぎますよこの業界はだからコンサル上がりの私がきっちりマネジメントしてやろうと思ったんですなんやと各地に散らばる極道組織を全国統一し極道社会全体を合理的な仕組みに一本化するいわば極道社会のアップデートですよこの古臭い業界を俺が全て塗り替えるんです上松やったんもその理想の民はユンク、ええ、極道社会の全国統一私はそのための足がかりとして自分の所属する登場会を支柱に収めようと考えました寺田をたぶらかして自分を押し上げてもらい邪魔な連中は排除していく上松もそうですしあんたもそうです、okay. so、part of it. もちろん寺田も時期を見て消すつもりでしたがね<笑>私はそうやって登場会を手に入れそれを大見連合に譲り渡そうと考えました近江に近江にはい登場会を近江に吸収合併してもらえば日本最大の極道組織が出来上がりますそうなれば全国統一はもう目前私はその組織の養殖につき極道社会を自分の理想色に染め上げる義理人情なんてくだらないものに左右されない合理的で近代的な極道社会を作り上げるんです<笑>くだらんなあなたなんだろうその価値はわからないでしょうねですが近江連合のある幹部にすでにこの話は通してあるんですよあとは実行に移すのみしかしスムーズに登場会と近江を合併に持っていくためには何か大きなきっかけが必要だそれが戦争ですよ<笑>登場会の人間が近江の幹部を殺せばこれに勝る火種はないだから河村に一肌脱いでもらったんですがどうせなら河村なんていうチンピラよりもあんたが殺したってことにした方が良さそうですね Stop hiding behind that gun, man. 悪いがあんたにはここで、like、man. いろんなもんを背負った上で死んでもらいますこの腐りきった極道社会を正すための礎になれるんだ悪い話じゃないでしょうどうせあんたはほっといたらろくな死に方しねえんだ今しんどいた方が値打ちが出ますよわしはお前なんぞに値段つけられるほど安い男ちゃうお前の理想なんかどうでもええわしはただ目の前におる気に食わんやつを殴るだけじゃ勢いだけで全てを変えられるわけありませんよそんな古臭いバカな極道はさっさと消えろって言ってんだよマジマーストゥーデスマジマーアマニダーゲッソンハウファーアドンゴルダファーマシーオーニーティングホーシュッスケーリー Ooh. Matrix. Nice. Ooh, that's so cool. Love that. Love that slow mo. Oh, wait. Let's heal up. Oh, cool. So I got somehow. Even though I didn't go to farm. Yeah. Let's get him close to 
him so that he doesn't use his gun. Ah, shit. But he can use less of his gun. I can't really block with Majimara, he's more of like a dodger. The end of your dream. <laughs> oh, does he let him go? Okay, never mind. Get him. Butabako de Kusai Mishimukte. Oh, is he, gonna, is he gonna let him go? Oh, he does. I thought he was saying that he won't. Because he got Karamura. Majima. <laughs> <笑>西と東の大戦争が起こり登場会は消える。これから面白いことになる。<笑> Oh, what? Okay, so he's calling himself to frame Majima still? I don't get it. Okay. I don't know. Majima san, Kono Tabi, Makoto ni Moshi Aki Arimasen de Shita. いい縁の根端を見抜ききれなかった。私の責任です。元々ある程度黒いもんを含んどるやつやとは思っていましたが、数字を重視するあまり数字にならないものを軽視。ブラインドバイマネー。私のやり方が間違っていたのかもしれません
それにイーブチの仕業とはいえうちの組員が近江の幹部をやったんは事実連中が黙っとるわけないやろはい実はすでに近江の方から説明の場を設けるよう求められております近江と戦争になったら今のうちはおしまいやせやから一つ提案がある提案マジマさん。Is he gonna retire? Oh. Wait, what does that mean? Is he gonna retire? <laughs> this scene is like deja vu, man. Instead of Kiryu, it's Majima this time. Majima and Tedda. この度は近江連合さんにご迷惑をかけてしまい申し訳ない申し訳ない何のんきなこと言うとる相変わらずぬるいの寺田はんはこっちはあんたらの内輪もめのせいで三次団体とはいえ幹部一人殺されとるんやでどない責任取るつもりや答えようによっては関東と関西の大戦争になるかもしれませんの<笑>まあ待て今日は喧嘩を売るためにこの場を設けたわけやないすみませんなうちのもんがいえせやけど戦国たちが言うとることも一理ありますこのままおとがめなしで穏便になんてことになったらうちの連中に示しがつかん私も戦争は望んではないどうおとしまいをつけていただくか、hey, What is there to do? それなんやが今回はいいぶちの件があったとはいえ結果的にうちの部下が起こしたことを責任は親のわしにある。どう責任を取ろうつもりですかマジマグミ。解散でどうや。何やとマジマグミ言うたら、登場会で現状一番幅利かせとる組やないき。そうないな組を解散って。勢いだけで何言うとるんやわしが解散言うたら解散なんじゃボケーマジマグミは解散わしを含め組員は全員登場会から足洗う今回はまことに申し訳ないそれで収めてもらえんやろか。Man, Majima's got such a big heart, eh? Such a big sacrifice. Just everything. He just cares so much about others. Cares so much about the clan. Like with Makoto, he sacrifices feelings. With this, he's sacrificing what he built, his own family. He's such a big man. せっかくの戦争勃発の大チャンスやったのにあのマジマカイワンのとこにしてやられたのそんなに戦争がしたいならあの場で噛みつけばよかっただろうあんだけ潔い姿勢見せられたら噛みつく方がやぼってもいいまあいずれにせよ登場会とは近いうちに戦争することになるやろからなその時まで、まあ、お楽しみは取っておくとするかぬ。<笑>戦争ね。そもそも今回のイーブチってやつも、あんたらのどっちかが仕組んだんじゃないですか。その言葉
そっくりあんたに返させてもらうあへん、this guy。Who was it? Can't be Ryuji, it's not a Ryuji style. マジなゴロ大した男や。Oh my gosh, are we gonna fight Ryuji in this as well with Majima? Probably, eh? Ah, yes, so that's when he becomes a construction worker. Sakum! Ohayo! Ohayo, my name is Marus. Koi ga jisei! Aisa ga dekehen ningen wa kensetsu mo dekehen de! Ore, yaru nash! あさんはい。おはようございます。何や。やればできるやないか。ですそうキュー。なる。初めからやるけ。ああ、あの、親父。あ。何や。本当に俺たち、マジマ建設なんて会社やっていくんすか。カムロチョヒルズなんてでかい建物を作るなんてノウハウもない俺らじゃ無理ですよ hey, アホか<笑>ノウハウもない<笑>何をあきのこと言うとるや<笑>そんなに建設建設の作業員が務まるわけないやろいや、exactly. だから務まらないんじゃないかって話なんですけどこの程度の仕事ネットで調べてとっとと建設やそそんな<笑> No expertise いいか Expert, expertise at all 今日からわしらの新しい人生が始まるんや極道ではなく肩たぎとして不眠不休で働けや文句を言うやつは給料抜きやいや、ぶち殺しされてぶ、ブラック企業だ<笑> Exciting, exciting times Oh, what's happening here? Oh, I thought Makoto was out, but she's back Wait, is she still in the story? What is happening? Oh my gosh, I hope. I hope they get to meet up again. That'd be awesome. Kore, Makoto san a t e de, mise ni todo ite tan desu. Okuri nushi ga kaite nai n desu kedo. Joren san kara desu ka ne? Oh, please. Can they meet up? Do they meet up again? Oh, it's the brown strap. <laughs> 昔私がしてたどうして古い方なので替えがこの色しか見つからなくてもともとのデザインがもっと落ち着いてて好きだったんですけどねベルトはさすがによれちゃったんで交換したんですけどねもう10年ぐらいかなずっと大事に使ってるんです Yes, it's Majima. She knows, eh? She has to know now. Oh, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the n e x No. All the chapters. All the chapters are closed now. For her. Huh. Okay, well, that's good. That's good for her, though.
Oh. <laughs> but there's still a part of me that wants Majima and her together. Oh, that's the end of it. <laughs> I thought there was going to be more with like the Omi Alliance and Majima, but I guess not. That was a really good ending then. I love how the big focus of this Majima story was between was about Makoto and Majima, because that's pretty much the highlight, for me at least, the highlight of the whole Yakuza story so far. Not saying the other storylines are bad, but Majima and Makoto is definitely, definitely my favourite couple in the story. And their storyline is definitely the best storyline so far for me. I just love just everything about them, how everything that's happened to them, how their the bond that they created was just really genuine. Um, and it's crazy how the story started where Majima needed to kill Makoto but then over just over time he s switched his motive around and he wanted to protect her and um, he just during that experience he fell in love with her and I'm pretty sure Makoto fell in love with him as well but yeah just everything about this story I love it so much. Even though Kiryu was the main character, the main person of this whole story, I really, I, I actually enjoyed the Majima and Makoto story a lot more than Kiryu's. <sighs> but no, those three chapters were really good. It was a pretty thorough story. It wasn't just little snippets here and there. Um, and I guess that really gave me the satisfaction that I needed for Majima and Makoto. But secretly I really want like a spin-off. What if the story, if it were to go a different way with Makoto and Majima getting together but like uh, I guess like a love story between those two. That would have been really cool to see if, they, if there was some sort of spin-off um, about Majima and Makoto in an alternate universe where they get together in the end but there's like a bit of drama between them two getting together that would be cool if they ever make something like that the conclusion from here is pretty good so i'm pretty satisfied anyway cool but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this one with me um hope you guys enjoyed the conclusion of majima makoto just as much, um, even though it's kind of bittersweet as you guys might agree as well. I'll see you guys in the next video uh, during the Cabaret Club finale. Alright guys, I'm going to put this in the same video, so I'm going to do the ending of the Cabaret Club, because yeah, the last chapter of, I didn't expect the Majima Saga to be that short, so I'm going to add this part. So yeah, let's get to it. Let's finish this competition against the other club. Let's go. Let's put all the platinum girls there. Maybe not her because she's not, her mood's not the best. Put these girls. Platinum. That's five out of the six platinum girls should be all good. I put some of the grandma on. Grandma's pretty her stats are pretty good, eh? Both grandmas actually. But let's balance it out. So party talk skill. Need a bit more love. Love. I need gold. Gold members. Love. Love love. Oh yeah, let's do her. Cool. I think those stats look pretty good. Party, talk, skill, love, pretty balanced kind of. Let's do this guys. Four shine versus leg champ. Ladies and gentlemen, my deepest apologies for the wait. It's time for the Cabaret Club Grand Prix Finals. I'm your host, God of Majima. He's really owning this, isn't he? Uh. Yeah, he doesn't take half measures. 
In this corner, the Cadbury Grand Prix Grand Champion, the Salt and Body Sunshine. Featuring the legendary host, Kirara, this club's a world famous establishment with some real clout. In the other corner, the challenger's Salt and Body Foreshine. Today, they aim to take down a legend, but do they got the skills to pay those bills? Kirara chan. <laughs> Yuki san. It's taken a long time, but I'm glad we're finally doing this. To truly become a legend, I need to beat you. The host's this world can only speak of one legend, and it's going to be me. It's never been about the status for me, but I can't lose all the same. The path I've walked, the girls I've worked alongside, the customers who loved us, I'll prove them right. This is where it ends, Kanzaki. Hmm. You're just a motley collection of drifters. With or without the inside sources, we're stronger. Now, we'll show you. Yay! I wish this whole part was voice stay. Come join our team, Kirara. But yeah, it'll be really cool if. Oh, nice! Three girls already starting. But it'd be really cool if this whole thing was voice day. Kinda wish they did, because the host club is a pretty major um, sub story. <laughs> What's up, Grandma? Uh, guest class. I nearly forgot what that sign was. Oh. Yay, yeah, I like Shoko. She's so cute. I like this one. So yeah, I think this is the first time I'm showing my cabaret club. Ah shit, she took away my girls. This is the first time I'm showing my cabaret club girls, eh? Uh, for each of the platinum girls, I try to max out the stats for at least three out of the four um, sexy, elegant, cute, and funny stats. So, some of them, looks-wise, is not really my preferred look, but it's what worked to max those stats out. ようこそ。ほうしゃい。ほうしゃい。フィーバー。ゲストクラス。キルちゃんがナイスサポートや。ほうしゃい。助けを求めてるみたいんやが。ゲストクラス。キルちゃんがナイスサポートや。ほうし
Yeah, I think my girls are gonna disappear. Most of them disappeared. It's okay. Let's get back. Let's get back to it. Heal up. Shit, okay, I need to catch up. I'm like one mil behind, man. Come on, come on, come on. Just be the... Keep fevering. Come on. Oh my gosh, I don't want to lose. Hana. Come on, sit down so I can fever again. Come on, come on. Come on, oh my gosh. I'm one more behind. Come on, come on. Shit, man. Oh my gosh, six seconds. Can I do it? Five. Shit, no, I don't think I can do it. Oh, just. Damn it. Oh, wait. Wait. Oil Baron here to save the day. I need to get it. 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 Okay, good. Okay. Thank God. Oil Baron here to save the day. Okay, good, good, good. That should be enough. So. Yeah, just. Just, because... Thank God for the Oil Baron. Nice, Grandma. I mean, yeah, the principal lady. Whew. And the winner is... Salt and body for shine. Yeah, this will be so good if this was voiced. So I can hear all their reactions. Hell yeah. We really did it. Yay. We did it, Yuki-san. Yeah, we did. It's all thanks to you guys too. And you too, Kiryu-san. You did great, Yuki-san. Grand, a new grand champion is born today. A job well done, Foreshine. <laughs> I lost Yuki-san. Kirara-chan. Yuki-san, you deserve to be the legend that you are. Looking at you tonight, I saw the same dream I used to chase. <sighs> I think the title and status may have gone to my head. I still have so much left to learn. Not at all. You are amazing out there, Kirara-chan. It's only because of you that we had to push ourselves so hard. Thank you for a great match. Yuki-san, likewise. Now, join our team. Join us, Kirara. Handshake shared between two legends of the biz. Emotions are running raw tonight, folks. Impossible. I practically sold my soul to the devil and come to spa and now I've lost. Tanzaki-kun, it's time to come clean. Why did you push us out of sunshine? Why did you take it over like that? I remember a time when you were an earnest worker, a little serious sometimes, but you always put the customer first. You're gonna turn around, change your ways. Oh, good. Sometimes the darkest path is the most convenient, I guess. What do you mean? In my time at Sunshine, I made a foolish mistake and co-signed a loan for a friend. It sat on me with massive, massive debt. A financial advisor I went to suggested that buying out cabaret clubs would be an easy way to recoup. I see. Ugh. All I had to do was force out the girls making the most money and jeopardize the club's bottom line to lower its value. At first it felt wrong, but it paid so well and it was so easy to do. I was able to just to ju to justify it. It was going so smoothly, it was hard to feel guilt anymore. I was even considered a safe bet by investors. They told me if I could buy out the sunshine, they'd invest in what would become the Kanzaki group. I didn't even think twice that I would be betraying my own employers. It was an obsession at that point. I may have the owner of the Kan I maybe have been the owner of the Kanzaki group, but it's not like the investors were patiently waiting for their returns. I w it was a constant struggle to stay afloat. I gave in to one too good to be true scheme after another. Kanzaki 
Be careful with success, Yuki-san. You'll end up like me, embraced by the cold, false hands of financial independence. Fortunately, that's not possible for me. Huh? You're right. Those temptations are dangerous, and they're ever-present too. It's easy to reach out to them. Even I've been tempted by some awful schemes. I don't claim to be a saint. But you know why I never gave in? Because I'm too proud of the work I do. Of the club. Of the girls. Of the staff. Too proud? I owe a lot to this job. It showed me who I was, but more importantly, who I could become. I love my work. So no matter how easy the money or how simple my life might become, I will never disgrace my club to do it. Yuki. So I'll be the change I want to see. I'll prove work isn't just a shortcut to wealth or to some final escape. If I don't, it wouldn't be fair to all the girls who put their dreams on the line to work for us, right? Yuki-san. Hostess will sell dreams to their customers to make their own come true. And if the club doesn't have their back, we don't deserve them at our, at our tables. Right on. At a girl. Selling dreams, huh? You think you can see that through forever? My hands are permanently strained. Stained. I'll be back to challenge you. To tear down those lofty words and ideals. Kanzaki-kun. If you still want to try after you start over from scratch, I'll be here. Bring it. Good words, Yuki. Most important of this hard work, eh? You can't get rich overnight. Yuki-san, that was the coolest thing you've ever said. I'm not cut out for being cool. It's exhausting. <laughs> You're a natural, man. All the same, that was really well said, Yuki-san. Was it? Heh. <laughs> Pretty badass, Yuki-chan. Well, once more for the folks back home. Foreshine is the new grand champ. Oh, that was good. And what Yuki said at the end, that was really, really, really well worded. I've just been told Kanzaki and Buono have been arrested for their crimes. That settles that, huh? Yeah. Nothing ever settles in this business. Just like Yuki said, there's always someone looking for a quick way to win. Sure. Ah, uh, really, Kiryu-san? I'm tired of having to fight for my club. Mm. <laughs> You'll keep fighting. You love it too much. Hey, come on. We're gonna get ready for our Grand Prix challenges, right? You always take this long with your makeup kit out of sun. Yay, so she did join us. Hmm, I think I'm about average. Makeup is as much of a weapon as a smile, I, I catch up. <gasps> Since when is two hours average? That's long even for me. What? Had a pudding cup over here. Anyone seen it? I ate it, Kana-chan. Oh, okay. Wait, what? You can't just eat other people's pudding cups, you chan Come on, guys. Get it together. We're gonna open. <sighs> What a shameful display. Oh, Yuki-san. You'll discover how easy it is to stay calm if you prepare for the evening in advance, like me. A hostess is 80% prep, 20% improv. Keep that ratio in mind and you'll be legends in no time. Yuki-san, you're still wearing slippers. I am? Oh crap. <laughs> Yuki-san. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Cabaret Club Grand Prix. Today begins Club Fourshine stint at the new Grand Champion. The finest club with a lineup of knockouts. Is this the end of the story or merely the beginning? The Cabaret Club world will have to keep both, both eyes on this place for sure. Everybody ready? Let's go get. Let's go out there and be ourselves today. Yeah. The man of the plan. I'm going all out. Sure thing. I'm ready for this. Just another day in paradise. For our customers, for ourselves, let's do what we love. Oh. Hey, this is our first time defending our title. Should we do the thing? What thing? What? What thing is it? You're in too, right, Kiryu-san? Mm. Just this once. Are they gonna do a dance? On my count. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, Kitty is happy though. <laughs> as long as he's happy with that. Yeah, that was quite enjoyable. A bit cheesy in the end, but that's just what I exactly what I expected from this part of the game. The next Yakuza game I'm looking at will be Yakuza 7. 
Uh, cause, yeah, I don't have Yakuza 3, 4, or 5. My brother only had one and two. So, I'm gonna be parking aside this franchise for now until Yakuza 7 is released, uh, to the western side of the world as well. Um, I mean, I'm not particularly rich, so I don't have enough money to buy all the games I want to play. So I'm picking and choosing the games that I do want to play. And I feel like uh, this is a pretty good spot to end the Kiryu uh, storyline. Um, one of you guys mentioned as well in the comments that Yakuza Kiwami 2 will probably be a good uh, place to stop um, if I'm not planning to continue on with Kiryu's story. There's still no release date for Yakuza 7A. Eh? Hopefully the crisis that's happening in the world right now is not affecting delay, it's not affecting the release date of some games. Hopefully uh, the games won't be delayed. Um, but yeah, like The Last of Us 2, that game is delayed due to the crisis that's happening. So yeah, hopefully there's no delays with uh, Yakuza 7. But yeah, thank you all so much for joining me. Um, if you've joined me from, if this is your first video with me, or if you've joined me from Yakuza 0, uh, thank you so much for joining me on my playthrough. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.